दिल्ली में मानव तस्करी का बड़ा मामला सामने आया है दिल्ली में उनतालीस नेपाल की लड़कियों को छुड़ाया गया है उनको बहुत मार पड़ती है स्टील वाले तार होते हैं उस तार को दोहरा करके उससे पीटते हैं सिगरेट से जला देते हैं वोट वाले डंडे से मारते हैं बाल को कट कर दो कट कट के भी देते सबसे छोटी में किसको देखा अभी तक दस साल The illegal trade of humans currently claims 24.9 million people across the globe and approximately 8 million of those live within India's borders. Trafficking is usually carried through false promises of marriage and safe refuge, kidnapping or outright sale by relatives. Poverty, gender discrimination, social exclusion, lack of awareness, illiteracy and poor governance systems are deemed responsible for human trafficking the victims suffer violent injuries and inhuman conditions with no possibilities of freeing themselves a significant portion of children trafficked are subjected to forced labor in factories farms and households young girls and women trafficked from india bangladesh and western regions are exploited sexually resulting in suffering traumas that last their whole lives Human trafficking is an illegal act in India. Yet the country remains the top destination for it. As an actress Desh Pandu, we identify human trafficking as a cause of humanitarian concern. We feel that there is an immediate need for greater public assistance in rehabilitation and justice for these victims. We decided to initiate Project Treya with the goal of providing assistance to these victims in reclaiming their lives. Project Treya, established in 2017, aims to empower, enrich and employ the victims of human trafficking. Our vision is to train them in the art of baking. and help them establish a micro business under the brand name of Bakery Wale. Treya currently has 8 young women as its prime beneficiaries. These women having faced the cruel atrocities were motivated to fight against the oppression they had faced by the society. They could connect our project's vision to their desire to become independent. For our project, we required an NGO which practices a right-based holistic approach towards human traffickers. So we partnered with Stop India who work on combating human trafficking in both curative and preventive ways not just in India but along the transnational borders of Nepal and Bangladesh Ramula Bhar Charitable Trust in Delhi provides us with beneficiaries and infrastructure for the project also runs a catering business by the name of Koshish with the victims of human trafficking Next we needed someone to impart the culinary skills to our beneficiaries for which Mrs Manju Monga who has 13 years of experience in world cuisines happily volunteered we also partnered with defense bakery founded in 1962 where under the guidance of chef ramesh joshi our beneficiaries learned how to make brownies and cookies it was imperative to us that we raise our voices against trafficking while working on this project 100 million global campaign launched in 2017 through Kailas Satyarthi Children Foundation works towards eradication of child labor and ensuring a free safe and educated childhood for each child from the stakeholders through our collaboration we have been able to raise awareness for child trafficking once trained our beneficiaries started producing varieties of muffins fruit cakes and flavored chocolates our work for treya is planned and divided into stages Each stage closely monitored by a set of different teams right from buying the raw materials supervising the production and to finally selling the products our sales strategy is divided into two phases phase 1 business to consumer and phase 2 business to business in phase 1 for understanding the consumer patterns we actively marketed our products through 
stalls at different colleges. The wide variety offered by us and the quality checks ensured during the production led to Bakery Wale selling its entire stock at almost every place. In phase 2, to create a steady flow of income, we began providing our products in college canteens, metro station stalls and roadhouse cafe. Bakery Valley also established itself as a regular supplier for various corporate offices and households in events of celebrations. Our product-wise average cost consisted of muffins of 12 rupees, chocolates of 3.25 rupees, brownies of 21.8 rupees, cookies of 8.08 rupees and cakes of 159.6 rupees. We started with an initial investment of 30,000 rupees for fixed equipment and 15,000 rupees for raw materials. We generated a total revenue of 2,64,653 rupees with a profit of 1,30,207 rupees. Chocolates comprised of 42% of the total revenue, while brownies comprised of 39%, cakes of 13%, muffins of 4% and cookies of 2%. We had a profit margin of 116.25% in tenure 1, 117.2% in tenure 2 and 138.36% in tenure 3. Treya has empowered its beneficiaries to loan in calf their own way. We have helped the victims of human trafficking regain what they lost, their independence, self-reliance and dignity. The direct impact of this project has been an additional source of income, helping them enroll themselves in education courses and settling in their new lives. Indirectly, we have been responsible for providing our beneficiaries and their families with access to clean water and sanitation, health facilities and food security. Under this project, we have covered SDG 5, Gender Equality, SDG 8, Decent Work and Economic Growth, SDG 10, Reduce Inequalities, and SDG 17, Partnership for the Goals. Treya, throughout its process of production, has been establishing practices that make us a responsible producer. We have actively chosen raw materials that have minimum packaging and shopped locally to encourage the micro businesses oil while maintaining the quality of our products. With Project Treya, our vision was not only to provide the entrepreneurial skills to our beneficiaries, but to provide them with a respectable standard of living and making themselves sustained. After three years of working on this project, we can proudly say that seven out of our eight beneficiaries have been rehabilitated. Our beneficiaries have been able to create their own success stories, regaining their social position by their hard work. We believe in the power. Empower!